Yo, what's up, guys? We watched all of Fiona and Cake. Every single episode. If you guys want us to make it to the end of other series and put out these giant binge videos, then make sure you subscribe and leave a like on this video. And if you guys want to see the full commentary tracks for every single episode, our full uncut reaction to every episode, then you're going to want to head over to patreon.com slash spilling the milk. Enjoy! This sounds so crackly. It's so funny. Oh my god, it looks amazing! So her name's Fiona Campbell? That's weird. What would that- Dude, that's a- What's it called? Totoro reference. Already? And Sailor Moon reference? This is just like being Puppy Cat. That's what I was about to say. It literally looks like being Puppy Cat. Fiona, stab! <laughs> Holy shit! That rat squeal! <laughs> that was so funny! That looked really good, actually. Yo, what the hell? This shit got, like, some real animation. I wish I had dreams like this, man. Like, this is awesome. How'd you know it was a dream, dude? Why'd you spoil that shit for me? This looks really good. This looks f sick. The backgrounds are cool. It looks like a f Like, look at the texture of the pool. Fiona! <laughs> is, that, is that one guy from Sailor Moon with a top hat gonna show up? Or are we not doing that? Oh my god. It's the Ice King. It is! It is! It's the fucking Sailor Moon reference. That's so wild. <laughs> Dude, this is so good. I, I, this is so awesome. This is so Canada coded, Jack. This does pl take place in Canada. The Ice Prince is just Justin Trudeau. Fiona. Oh my God, dude, the Ice Tuxedo Sam is so hot in this. Can we talk about that? I need him. I need him. Egg, 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 egg. That's so funny. I, I need to make that my alarm. Egg, egg, egg. Wait, what the hell? Depression? Is this a depression pilled spinoff right now that we're watching? No, she's called an early 20s dumb fuck who doesn't know how to clean her apartment. Every time I leave my room, I wanna die. This does not feel like Adventure Time at all. We're watching a different show. This is depressing, bro. Holy shit. This is depressing? I think it's cute. Do you, are you listening to what the lyrics are saying, Jack? No, I'm not. These are very depressing lyrics, Jack. It's the third night in a row I've dreamed about a mysterious ice prince. That's how you know this is rated TV 14. Was she wearing a bu 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 bra? What? B -b -b girl clothing? What? You haven't really eaten in like three days. Oh, yet her cat's gonna die because she can't afford to take it to the vet. You fucking feed sandwiches to your cat? What is wrong with you? Stop acting crazy. Your cat hasn't eaten for three days. It's not acting crazy. It needs food. That's what I do when my baby cries. Stop acting crazy. And then you shake it rapidly. <laughs> so guess you're coming to work with me, pal. This is a very much a slice of life right now. Is this like a global warming commentary? Like it's too hot for the cat. That's why they're going with the ice. No, the ice king. The ice king is in her freezer. That's going to be the plot twist of the episode. Dude, these are all characters from the show. Oh my goodness, it's all the characters we know and love. This is Deltarune. This is the Deltarune of Adventure Time. Am I wrong? We all have weird food dreams, okay? But my dream is special. I had to dream about a pickle once. Bro thinks she's MLK. You're not MLK. I've gotten several complaints about your tours. Who is this? This is their queen. This is their boss. Queen of Ooh? Is this supposed to be King of Ooh? Oh, looks nothing like King of Ooh. You never even wanted this stupid job in the first place. And no one even cares about your darn tours! <gasps> is that allowed? You know what's really funny about this? Is that like the YouTube trailer for this says it's for YouTube kids. And this fucking like 20 something woman just pants in public. Like this is not- That was also supposed to be like flicking someone off right there. What she just did with the peace sign. Order for CB. Oh God. The sexy old cinnamon bun. Cause she's bad. They didn't even make them vaguely look like a human being. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Does this cat have, like, magic senses? No, because the cat is trying to signal something about ice. Like, maybe she's gonna be like, maybe if I got enough ice together in one place, the Ice King will show up or something like that. Well, that's what she's trying to do. They're doing the mouse test. Oh, did you test on mice first? Yeah. That's inhumane, though. They're doing animal testing. Yeah, also, why would you want food in your bakery that mice like? You wouldn't want the mice there in the first place. Well, the mice are after the good shit, bro. They definitely don't eat garbage. Like, mice definitely only eat good, high-quality food. Maybe that was Remy from Ratatouille. 
Yeah, the vibes of this are so chill compared to Adventure Time. I mean, just the fact that the episode is more than 11 minutes long, like, kind of shows that it's going to be a completely different show. We got a fucking exclusive Donald Glover song. Oh, you okay? Damn it, my uniform! What did she just say? Is that allowed? Oh, because she said damn. Dude, think about it. Think about it. Here's my evil capitalist theory. It's a good thing that Cartoon Network died because now we get mm. curse words in our cartoons. Think about that. Is damn a fucking curse word? It's fucking damn, bro. <laughs> get your woke fucking bitch ass out of here, bro. Who cares? Do they get one fuck a season? I hope so. My buddy Ellis can fix her up and he'd only charge you like... A couple of these. What? Some cookies? <laughs> Some cookies? <laughs> what? <laughs> My friend doesn't make any money. He he's morbidly obese. <laughs> Give him, feed him cookies. He lives in Central Park. <laughs> he just wait. I just. I just realized, is that Betty in the fucking fountain? Oh my god. Is that like a voluptuous version of Betty at the fountain? Betty was always voluptuous. She didn't have a single curve in her entire body. I'll put him in there myself. Sorry, traveler. I mean, no harm. Oh my god. Why does this person look so scary? <laughs> they have Huntress Wizard eyes, bro. Hunter, look at the ass. That's how you know it's Huntress Wizard. Look at the fucking ass. Holy shit. They just liquefied the ass, bro. They, they just like stretched that shit out in Photoshop. Did you know that any plant can be considered a weed? Weed. Okay, this, this, I feel like the show goes so hard if I was high. Like th this, the w the vibes of this is similar to something like the Midnight Gospel, but like there's actually like a story. And it's like good. And it's like actually good. Yeah. Just close your eyes and blow. Cut that out of context. Just close your eyes and blow. That's how that's how she's gonna make her money. She's gotta make money somehow. One for Butch, one for Stanley. <gasps> Lumpy Space Princess! Lumpy Space Princess is a fucking Yas Queen! Yas King, thank you very much. That's Alice P. Wait, Ellis! Their name is Ellis P. Their name is Ellis P. That's so funny. <laughs> I love it, bro. I love it. That's so funny. Excuse me? Ah, stranger! Get her, boys! Eat her face! I like how all the characters in the show are kind of different and like more chill versions. And then Ellis P is like sounds the exact same. I feel like this is the most one-to-one -one for all the characters. Like Ellis P as a human, this is it. I didn't expect anything different. It's just the same person. It's literally Literally just the same person. Try not to freak out when you see my powers in action. Catnip. He's gonna drug the cat. He's literally a stoner. That's the whole point. He's a fucking stoner who lives in the woods. Maybe she feels trapped in my crummy little apartment? I don't think so, bro. That's a pretty decent sized apartment for New York City. Like, let's be realistic here. Yeah, that's like a that's like a six person house in Tokyo. She's just bored with everything and wishes the world was more magical. That's you, bro. That sounds like a bit of a you problem. The anime portal. So is she going to get transferred to like Adventure Time World? And then there's just going to be like a version of Finn, but then also a version of Fiona? Like, oh my God. The lemon grabs are Karens. That is perfect. That is amazing. What? What just ha What? What the hell? Oh my God. Whoa. Oh, shit. Holy shit. Yo. Yo! What the fuck? What the hell? That was awesome. What the hell? Are they I think they're going to be traveling interdimensionally. <laughs> we got Spider-Verse for Adventure Time fans. We have won. We have won, people. It's the goats. Simon and Marcy. Oh, and she's got her little monkey, Plimbo or whatever. Aww. Not to worry. Guess who always carries around? A sewing kit. He's adorable. <laughs> what a cute little man. Don't put it on, bro. Yo. Simon it's tempting. Petrica. That's a cool title. <laughs> <laughs> they really like Cheers. That's that's what I've mostly learned from watching this. Why is every channel like what is the joke? I don't get the joke. Why is it like that? Bro has a pillow that says be yourself. Like, how fucking baby boomer is Simon, bro? It's it's, it's insane. Uh, is what? that supposed to happen? What? Oh. 20th what century man in his natural here? habitat. This is just their equivalent of Jamestown. <sighs> Anyone? This is Adventure Time Land? This is an Adventure Time amusement park? Oh, uh, it's a phone. What's that above it? Also a phone. This also a phone? It's a blow dryer. Why isn't it a phone? 
<laughs> Refrigerators had freezer compartments, many of which made their own. You see, they're foreshadowing. I'm telling you, bro, my theory, my 1000 IQ theory, Simon is living in Fiona's freezer. He used to be a really cool ice wizard who wrote my favorite book series and turned him into a boring, sad guy. <laughs> Child cry, what the hell? You threw her book in the trash, bro. That's kind of fun. What the fuck is that? What the the Enchiridion? Where the fuck is this is the adventure time room? What the fuck is this? This is the gravity falls room. <laughs> oh my god, he's like actually mentally not okay. I'm scared. Alright, straight up. You got it. <laughs> he just destroys the glass. Shall I put it on your tab? Yeah. This is that. weird, though, because Simon is an alcohol. This is like we <gasps> grow up. The people that we liked in Hollywood are all, like, washed up alcoholics. And since it's happening with our cartoon characters now, too. Same old, same old. He is not fine. Huh. That's really something. <laughs> that is that is a very funny reaction. Your old stuff, Fiona and Cake, I mean, honest to glob, man. It is such an inspiration. Everyone is so obsessed with the Fiona and Cake fanfic. I thought nobody liked it. Finn! Oh my god, he's what? so big! Jake loved him. Jake's dead in this, no! Not just your boy Finn the H. You know why Finn looks weird? He has a neck. It's like every cartoon time skip, just like Steven Universe. Slog towards... Towards... What? <laughs> oh, that's funny, dude. Friend, I'm taking you on a quest. That's just the thing to make you feel better. The jorts are crazy, though. Look at his legs. He has literally yes. no drip whatsoever. <laughs> this is an abomination to God what this man is wearing right now. <laughs> The cartoony off. We're in the most ancient part of U. Pretty. Huntress Wizard calls it the heart of the forest. Are they implying he got married to Huntress Wizard? Because, like, I need that in my life. I need it to be canon, you know what I'm saying? I feel like both Finn and Huntress Wizard wouldn't believe in marriage as a concept. Why do you have to ruin my childhood, bro? Oh. Oh. Simon Moaning. Oh. <laughs> It's just so weird how serious this is. Oh my. That's Gary the Snail. Meow, fuck out the way. No, no. Meow, no. fuck out the way. Meow, fuck out the way. Oh, okay. Ew, that was what? hot. You're just gonna eat an egg? Oh, I'm not gonna eat it. It's for the coffee. What? You putting the shell in the coffee? So that's what cowboy tastes like. <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> Oh, it's the lich bear. It's not a lich. Stop calling <laughs> Oh my no, no, it's Persona 5 Joker bear. He has the mask. <laughs> he just snapped its fucking neck with his body. I'll walk you part way. Okay, let's go. <laughs> it makes you think That's he's gonna so bandage funny. him up and That's he just- That's so funny. Finn is not a good friend at all in this. Like, no, I would not want to be with him in this scenario. Well, thanks, Finn, for everything. No prob, Bob. No prob, Bob. Cry. Rebecca Sugar moment? Oh yeah, it's the Those same, are the same people. people. She, he's experiencing the same thing. He's experiencing the same fucking thing. I mean, you won't believe- She's getting a tattoo right now. Oh my god, they're so gay. Made a little girl cry earlier today. <laughs> Wait, what was that? Can you say it again? Louder? Uh, it's nothing. Everything's fine. <laughs> That oh, looks so fucking weird. What that the? That actually looks so fuck. That's like some trypophobia type shit. Oh, Is he gonna do a oh, tribute to that Betty picture? Oh my god, what is he doing? What the? Men will do anything for pussy. Me passage, reveal the path and equivalent. Tetris. Tetris. Oh, he's Tetris. Tetris. He's oh, playing he Tetris. Tetris. <laughs> Oh, what? the cat is here yeah. now. Oh my god, is is uh is cake gonna eat like the cake cake fruit or some shit? <laughs> this sounds like some shit that's gonna be on scaring the host three. Like I can hear Danny Brown rapping on this.
War. That's what it is. Fiona and Cake live inside of Simon or Ice King's stomach. They've just been vored by him millennia ago. That's the lore. <laughs> They really don't want anyone taking this egg. This is weird. It's like a young adult Finn right now. How old is Jake in this? Like, bro must be on his deathbed or something. <laughs> is this before Jake dies or something? Are they going to show well, Jake's death? He is on screen right now, Jack. Why are you asking that? <laughs> he is alive. He got the tattoo before Jake died? I just thought it implied. Jake suit! That's Jake suit! Oh my god, I'm such a loser. <laughs> the Jake suit is so gross. The Jake suit is fucking disgusting. It's the gross thing ever. My cat's in there! Hey! Cake! Any cookie cat's, cats in there? <laughs> what? <laughs> what an asshole! What the fuck? What do you mean, asshole? Who's the asshole in this situation? We need an R slash am I the asshole for this situation because I don't know who the asshole is, Jack. Cake still can't talk? When does she get the human speech? Dude, cats can't speak, Eden. From Prismo, maybe? I'm just gonna... Fiona! Fiona! Where am I? Let go! Wait, Cake is a guy? No, Cake is not a guy. It just Fiona, defaults to Fiona, that voice. Cake is a guy? Cake is a guy? <laughs> Choose Goose! There's just a fried alive Choose Goose chilling in the living room of this Would you eat it? Scene. Would you eat the Choose Goose? Honestly, like, get some cordon bleu. Like, that'd be tasting pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Open! Door open! <gasps> yes! <gasps> oh my oh god, I thought it was gonna my die. God. That would be so funny if it just got one. murdered. That would have been the Family Guy moment we've all been asking for, where Cake the Cat gets hit by a car. Fiona? Ah! What the fuck are those balls? It's literally the same character design, but they just put crazy balls on it. Hey, look, it's it. Finn's Yo! mom, but it's not actually Finn's mom. It's a copy of Finn's mom because I don't want to spoil all of Islands for you. Go watch Islands. <laughs> Oh my god, two-headed goose! The amount of two-headed goose representation is so beautiful. Like, as a two-headed goose myself, like, that's really wonderful. Where's your other head? You don't want to know, dude. You don't. <laughs> I really want to know. Don't want, you do not want to know. Let me Trust take me. a look under the curtain, bro. Butterfly. Oh my god, but like, where's the bees? Where's the bees? Where's the bees here? Bug. There's the bees! There's the bees! Yes! No one thought it would happen, bro. No one thought that we would be blessed with butterflies and bees in the same place again, but it happens, bro. What are you doing? Come on. Don't touch my thing! This squirrel looks like a Casey Green character design. Yeah, he looks like he belongs in, like, I am a good boy. He looks like a Looney Tunes character or something. Or like a Berenstein Bears <laughs> cover art. <laughs> Is this how she's gonna get her powers? She just eats like a cursed apple or something? <laughs> this is fucking Cartman's creations, isn't it? This is the Woodland Tree Friends. I hope it doesn't end up like South Park. I don't want Adventure Time to be like South Park at all. Cake, you must birth the Antichrist. Eat my bushy tail. Wow. Oh. <laughs> They're beating the fuck out of him. <laughs> They're jumping me. They're jumping me. <laughs> This is a commentary on how cats are an invasive species in our environment. Fiona let her cat out, and now it's like disrupting this environment because it's too OP. Sorry, friend. I ran into some trouble, but this hero saved my bacon. Can I be honest? I really don't like this squirrel character. I think he's ruining the entire episode right now. Is that healthy? No. <laughs> but I feel like I didn't choose the apple. The apple chose me. Whoa! Whoa! I need that one. That was the real cake. Wait, so how do these powers work? Is this like devil fruit logic where it's like the first bite that you take or something? This is a universe where devil fruits are absurdly easy to come by. I just need the get get fruit. I think that's all I need. La da da da. This guy looks like a Lord of the Rings character. I didn't know they could be this bendable. Maybe I'm missing all. This is weird. This show is way more musical than Adventure Time like ever was. There was like a couple songs a season. This like every single episode has like a full length song. Maybe they started raking in them like Spotify so like views on their music. They're trying to get the and Spotify plays. They don't even the care about the streaming numbers. You're nothing but a spell battery to me. 
you probably only have one good job. Yo, he looks like fucking tentacles. I hope your tentacles don't look like that. Well, I mean, just the bottom part. Maybe I'm missing, or maybe I'm cake on the loose. With some Those little hot dog warriors. The hot dog knights. No. What? <laughs> they turned into... What the fuck is going on? They just canonically killed one of the hot dog warriors. Like, how can you just do that? The show is so fucked up, man. She's fucking everything up. Go back to your world. You're ruining Adventure Time. <laughs> she did just murder everyone in the town. Well, it's like sometimes when you get really immersed in your song, like you just beat people to death and like you can't really complain about that. I was waiting for him to slap her ass as he walked past. <laughs> no, maybe if it was Neil Patrick Harris playing the character still, then maybe. Too huh? much ice. Ice. Ice spice. Ice cube. She's bad like the Barbie. She's bad like the Barbie. Oh, I see. He was thinking about Betty's ass and he got it mixed up. Oh my god. <laughs> Choose Goose. He's black now. Look how charred he is. Is Choose Goose fucking dead? He has been electrocuted so many times. He is a rotisserie chicken at this point. Uh, holy cow. What, what a nonchalant Jack reaction. <laughs> holy cow. Jack. How long is that girl gonna stand there with her? Oh, that's what I was wondering. Yeah, I was gonna say, take the- You're just gonna point vaguely to the direction and then head off. You're not gonna want, like, any more information. No. They ain't got Google Maps in the land of Ooh or something. Welcome to Ooh, Fiona. I think you're gonna like it here. Yeah, me too. This is isekai for Americans. Can we talk about that? Uh-oh. Where is she? Your cat's getting beat to death. Kay kind of deserves it. Look at the Look gate at that leaping leap. ass! <laughs> I thought I'd lost you forever. That ant is pissed. I love how fucking shitty all the people in this town look. Like these are all like the rejected Adventure Time characters. Ugh. Ha! You suck! <laughs> what the fuck are we watching right now? They're just fucking okay. murdering these people. I'm not people. gonna lie. This is female Finn. Because Finn also has like no <laughs> qualms when it comes to killing people. Like Finn low-key does not give a fuck. I feel like the key difference is that Fiona is like in her 20s and Finn was like a 13-year-old at the start of the series. <laughs> Can we go on an adventure? <laughs> well... <laughs> what is going on in this fucking show? Did Prismo beam them up? Oh, Prismo. Something? Prismo beamed them up. Beam me up, Prismo. Ew, ew, ew. Tumblr. Yeah, this is a Tumblr sissy, man. Well, the tongue is a straw. He could sound you with his tongue. He could slurp up anything he well, wants. Well, think about it. Like, if you have, like, a clog in any part of your body, <laughs> he could easily reach in there. He probably works really well with pets. Yeah, I don't know what's going on, bro. This is a lot. Oh my god, that shit looks like- that's literally a fucking Deoxys, dude. He's Deoxys. It's a Tamagotchi! He just turned the giant flame into a Tamagotchi, and now he's putting it into a giant fucking crystal. He's collected them all! He's collecting all the Tamagotchis! No. No. Prismo! You can't kill Prismo! You can't do that! Ahem. <clears throat> Aren't you gonna answer that? <laughs> uh. Why is Why it? Why it? Why it? Why you gotta be the most irrelevant, irrelevant character in the entire show? Why is he here right now? Oh, I wish it was quiet enough to think. Wish granted. Oh wait. Uh. What? <laughs> Classic Wyatt L. This looks so good, too. And Tree Trunks. Tree Trunks was on the train. No. Fuck you, Prismo. <laughs> this is so cool. That was awesome. I loved everything about that. What's going on now, Cake? I don't know, but this is cool. Ugh. What's wrong with Cake's voice? <laughs> <laughs> He's mean. He's, like, actually mean now. Hey. He's off-model, too. 
She's off model. She's off. What? 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 That's so weird. Motherfucker pulled up to the studio in Korea. There's like this really long going theory that Prismo is supposed to be this third wall breaking being. The reason he does what he does in the show is to make the show better. Like he's supposed to be an extension of what the viewers want. This is kind of confirming that long running theory. Closer look. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> They're not gonna show us I'm come on. Mm, drink the water, you beast. You not hearing Justin Roland voice lemon grab is Yeah, up. you're right. That is oh my up. god, it's so weird. Yeah, nobody can do the voice. Nobody can do it. No! Why'd you have to do that, Justin? Unacceptable! Made this farm world universe. A wish made this funny shape universe. This one already existed. Flapjack! What? Why is there just a <laughs> flapjack shout out? She'll need a badass sword. Everyone needs a best friend. Oh, cats are cool. Okay, so he is the writer of the show. So he is he's the, the one who was beaming it to Ice King. Marshall's a vampire! <laughs> <laughs> wow. We look so happy. This is so bizarre. Fiona and Cake was real this whole time? He's getting fucked. <laughs> I fuck with alcoholism in my cartoon show. Dude, I'm watching my favorite cartoon characters turn into alcoholics. I'm scared <laughs> and I want to go home. Can I store a fan-made alternate <laughs> universe in your cursed dome? Sure, magic flashlight. You could put anything you want in <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, fire in the hole. It's kind of weirdly satisfying to see old school Ice King. Your crown! What? Oh, when he became normal, the Fiona and Cake universe became normal. Oh shit, dude. And Magic Man became normal, man. Everyone's becoming normal! He wasn't fun. He was insane. I don't know. He looked pretty happy to me. Everybody is gaslighting Simon so hard. You don't know what you have until you lost it. You know what I'm saying? No one fucked with Ice King. All of a sudden, Ice King's gone. Everybody fucked with Ice King, huh? It's like when a shitty rapper dies, everybody wants to pretend their music was good. I'll deal with whoever that is. You guys follow me to the exit. <laughs> That's so cool. Okay, I'm being honest with you. If they kill Prisma, I'm not watching the show. I'm dropping the show. I'm going to pretend that this spin-off series does not exist. They've already killed him once. Oh my god, it's that one temple in Persona 5, bro. This is the Squid Game stairs. This is the Squid Game stairs from Persona 5. This is when Joker was like, I'm going to win the Squid Game. Weird. You never had any trouble with skirts in my stories. Ah. No! 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 Don't take her skirt away! Prismo's woke! Shorts look better. <laughs> oh, uh, that's mine. Is this cat hair yours? The last frame, half a second ago, that hair was not there, bro. You cannot be fooling me like that. Who the fuck do you think you are? Adventure Time thinks it has like two IQ, bro. Well, it's a kid show, bro. Well, according to YouTube, it's for kids only. <laughs> What the fuck is going on, man? They create time. That kind of made your universe off the books. It can't really be a part of the multiverse. Literally Spider-Verse. It's literally just Spider-Verse again. This is the anomaly that shouldn't exist, but it exists. <laughs> and Fiona Cakes in the universe and it shouldn't exist. And every fucking multiverse is the same! We need a Spider-Verse for white people. As a Caucasian male in my early 20s, I just couldn't enjoy Spider-Verse. But now that this is a show for Caucasians, I can relate. No way. I am not going through that heartache again. It's so oh, weird yeah, so hearing Tom Kenny be so serious. It's kind of unsettling. It's like hearing depressed SpongeBob. That's the last time I make an unauthorized universe. Unauthorized universe? This man cannot keep his mouth shut. Like, literally, what he's experiencing with having to talk on one side and having to talk on the other side is just what it's like to work fast food drive through You just handed me the only thing I want. My pickles? The time room! <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, the pickles are more valuable than the time room. These pickles have the best Yelp review out of any pickle in the multiverse. That's scary. This is a scary perspective. She could have done that the entire time. Like, do you think like maybe she's like signaling to Fiona that she wants her to like do more cardio? That's why Adventure she made her time. run the majority of the way. <laughs> Your fat ass needs more of a workout. Here, run and keep running. This dude will hunt you like a 
polar bear. How is he pushing the? He's like a projection of light on a wall. <laughs> he's not even real. Like. Actually, I think I might be able to. Did he die? Oh, he's, he's just a projection. I used to be able to stop whole armies of jerks like that, but I'm useless now. Literally just a washed up old man. That's his entire personality. The Simon depression is getting to be too much. Like it's it's feeling like Bojack. We're watching him spiral every episode. It's getting awkward, man. I need to become Ice King again. No, no way. fucking way. Wait, but doesn't he have to like kill Gunter or some shit to make that happen? This is Destiny. You think this episode's about Destiny? Fiona's gonna get into a debate. Yeah, so Simon is Destiny and Fiona's like Hassan. And they had to get into a crazy <laughs> political debate. And then Cake is like some random fucking like Ludwig streamer. Dude, this is me and the wife. Me and the wife, bro. Holy shit. This is the Finn the human verse. Oh, when Finn had the fucked up nose in that one episode. The fucked up nose? He had a disgusting fucking gross nose i remember this episode did the writers for this spinoff like literally just go to wattpad for like the idea for the show because like everything that has been in the show so far has been like stuff that people have, like theorized or like at least made fan fiction of that's kind of the basis for fiona and cake existing as characters you know what that's that's a really good point you're actually really correct that's on really that correct. magic will be restored to your world just like you want hmm Sounds great. No downsides. Why does the hand look so disgusting? It's like when you fall asleep on your arm and it's just like all fucked up afterwards. Yeah, it puffs out. What the fuck? Uh, uh. Fiona? Can you imagine falling asleep in like the most slave position possible? That's the most slave position possible. It is. See, that's the family guy death. That's Peter Griffin death. And Peter Griffin is the epitome of slave. I got you something to eat. Huh? Ooh. Why is there a dead rat? Why do they have to include that she just murdered a rat with her thick ass fucking booty? Like, why do they have to include that? I don't think Fiona killed the rat. Hold this for me. Any excuse to be more naked. Can't do that in a children's show. She said any excuse to be more naked. Cake is so fucking horny, bro. Is that allowed? Hubba hubba. Chad, stop being horny, bro. We should keep a low profile until we know what's what. I've played a lot of post-apocalyptic RPGs. The more loot, the better. She's played a lot of post-apocalyptic RPGs. She loves playing Fallout New Vegas, dude. Dude, this is like Adventure Time El Camino. They went to Mexico. What the fuck? <laughs> tires, tires, they're around the rubber. Get them here. Oh my god. What the fuck is going on in this <laughs> fucked up town? Is this what Mexico is like? Don't ask me that question because I'll give an answer that might offend people. <laughs> meow, meow. Is that what you want? Hey, a library. The power of reading. Libraries are cool. What? I love how he has the thing on his head though. Everyone just has random bullshit on their heads. What is with this society? In the defeat of the snowman. Big destiny. Oh, it's this guy. This is the guy that bullied Finn in the one episode. Today, we party for the dead body of popcorn. Woo! Old man popcorn finally croak. <laughs> Ugh, dude, you know what this feels like? No, I'm not gonna say it. Say it. This feels like a, like a JoJo arc. We're getting introduced to the big players. Popcorn seemed cool. Is that Finn Chan? That's Finn. That's not Finn Chan. That's Finn's little baby brother. Did you not pay attention to the lore? It's like I said. You gotta punch and push your way around to get what you want. Starchy. How many fucking Starchies are there, dude? I'm starting to get concerned, bro. In every universe, Starchy ends up with Finn. And in every universe, he regrets it. And that's fucking Wildberry Princess. I'm kind of over it. I'm kind of over the multiverse at this point. How many fucking Choose Gooses Wildberry Princesses do I need, okay? The crown is but the rarest of treasure. Present your wares, and I'll take their measure. Maybe this is like Choose Seuss, because he always likes rhyming. Maybe Choose Goose just is Dr. Seuss in another world. This guy was in the original show, so I think they did give him a name, but I forgot. Mm. A futuristic device. I think that's pretty nice. Well, it's no good to me here anyway. Check out the Blackberry. Are you kidding me right now? You can play Worm. You can play Worm. You gave away Worm. Worm. Are you playing with your Worm core? Here, my dear. It's a fake crown. You got burned, and I don't care. 
you crook! Oh. Holy fuck. Everything she does looks disgusting. Like the red That shit looks like arm. a floppy penis. Ew, ew, ew. Her powers are like short circuiting or something. Nobody saw that. Magic cat. Ooh, I'ma eat that cat. <laughs> that guy looks terrified. What? This is the duo that you don't fuck with, bro. He said, ooh, I'ma eat that cat. <laughs> what the fuck? This guy's named Trauma John. That's my favorite character in the show so far. <laughs> he looks like that dude from Ghost in the Shell. You're a long way from home, Jay. Destiny gang gonna kick Remember your, your place. Ugh. No, there's just so much slapping. Like everybody's constantly bitch slapping each other in this show. Dude, now I know why Trauma John has so much trauma though. It makes sense. What a deep, profound character, I must say. I can tell you're new here. Locals don't like talking about magic. Do you? Wait, Jay is Finn's son from the pillow world. What? What? Oh. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. Shut what? the fuck no up. No fucking way. Dad. What? Oh my god, he's daddy. What the fuck is happening right now? Apocalypse you. <gasps> you brought outsiders. <laughs> you brought outsiders. <laughs> Hearing the Finn's voice actor try and be cool is the funniest fucking thing I've ever heard. He's trying his best, man. He's trying his best, okay? I don't truck with magic. You know that. A truck with He's magic. A trucker. What's on his trucker hat? I refuse to believe that they write anything in this show, dude. Kids, set the table for three more. Yes, daddy. Damn, Finn was pumping him out. Well, I guess he wasn't pumping him out. Jake is about to die. Sorry. Where's human huntress wizard? I need there to be a human huntress wizard so people can create fine art of them. Scooch. Dad, there's a cat at the table. Wait, that girl who's part of the Destiny gang had the same hair as that kid. So does that mean that that girl is also Finn's daughter? There was just somebody in the tree. No, it was a dead body. Are we watching Infinity Train right now? You there. Have you seen a group of travelers? Why would you choose to have the hairline of like me? He needs to fit into the world. Man, cat, and woman followed Jay Merton's west. I hope that answers your request. Does he ever fuck up and like fail to rhyme? Then he like dies. He has a heart attack on the spot. Kendrick Lamar conceded to choose Goose in season three of Adventure. He's been freestyling okay. since he came out the womb. They will once we find that magic crown and plop it on Simon. Wow. You're looking for a magic crown? You're looking for a magic He's such a fucking cowboy in this. Dude, look at his packs though. I just want to touch his titties, bro. Jay tells us that you know something of its past. And... You're a damn fool! <laughs> Swearing? You're a darn fool. What the heck, dude? You're totally a fool, man. I'm Jeremy Shada, dude. Yeah, you two should kiss. You two should kiss. Why did Cake say that? You two should kiss? That's like an alternate version of yourself. That's like f***ing yourself. And? And? Okay, if you went to another world and there was an opposite gender version of yourself that was sexy, you wouldn't fuck them? Genetically, the DNA is not the same. I would f*** the, the shit out of them. Okay, I didn't even finish saying that. I didn't even have to finish my sentence. That's crazy. Come on. I was heading to the crater anyway. Can I come? Bonnie! Please! Bonnie's gonna die. I'm calling it. Good evening, Mr. Mertens, is it? <laughs> <laughs> this is like Logan. Yeah, it does give that vibe. I'm watching fucking Last of Us right now. Hey, Simon, what does it smell like? I can sniff it out with my cat senses. That was weird. Jake made the conscious effort of never making his nose bigger because that is disgusting and weird. Looks like the crown was annihilated by some very powerful magic. Go. Go. Jake! Wait, that's your sister. What? That's your sister. No, what it you isn't. Talking? No, it that's isn't. Why not his that? sister. Why are you it's... saying that? Mathematical. <gasps> that's what Finn says. See, I told you. She's been doing mouth high fives with our enemy. Mouth high fives. <laughs> <laughs> This is like the least crazy action of all time. So slow. Jay gave it to me. We're in love. Ha! Love is weak. Oh, that's a piece of the magic crown. Wait, that's a piece of the ma- I actually came to that realization the second before he said that. Me and Simon are like literally the same person, bro. Prove that you're big time. Huh? 
It's Buford or whatever his name was. The horse is fucking hilarious looking. Or the mule or donkey. That ain't no James Baxter though, I'll tell you that much. He's beautiful. Did you see how gorgeous the Destiny guy's eyes he are? He had beautiful like, eyes. I don't know why he's so afraid of showing them to the world. Did he just die? Did he just impale his head? Finn said, they killed Finn. Let's fucking go. Brian David Gilbert is in this episode. What? Who the fuck is Brian David Gilbert? He's the unraveled guy. I love him. I love him. You're supposed to help me shop today. She didn't even lock her door. Like zero survival instinct. Hello? Bitch, you live like this? She's been robbed. Nah. Whoa! Whoa! Are they gay? They're gay. They're, they're not gay. They gay. He gay. was canonical. He was they're gay. Fucking, Dude, they're he gay. He was they're gay. Fiona. Just let them be gay, Jack. Let no! Why was he embarrassed when he saw a shirtless man? Is it because he wanted to suck his c Maybe. I'll allow one of them to be gay, but not both. <laughs> Worry not, friends. You're safe now. Oh my god, it's the Ice King, what the hell? Oh my god, that's so adorable! It looks like a fucking Emporion! <laughs> Brian David Gilbert is the Winter King? Cake didn't mean any harm. A cat named Cake? <laughs> that's Brian David oh, Gilbert! Oh, it is! That's awesome! That's fucking awesome! This is going to sound nuts, but I think I've been dreaming about you. That's the Steven Universe bitch on the right! He's got some pearls on the right. Dear sweet Simon, allow me to share that wisdom, if I may. Does he have a song? Is he gonna sing? Let's go. I was once just like you. Brian David Gilbert has a song in the Adventure Time show. This is awesome. This, this is this is the Patrick McHale and Blasting Company song. It's giving Yaoi though. Am I allowed to say that? This is fucking awesome. This is fucking sick. This show is good now. Let's go. Tree. And a fine menagerie. Oh my god, it looks so beautiful. I love musicals. I don't mean to say every frame is a painting, but like screenshot any frame and this shit is fucking beautiful. In the soft snowflakes swirl in my winter wonder world. Is this just another Princess Bubblegum situation where he's like an authoritarian person in his society? Maybe that was in the lyrics, but I was too distracted by how beautiful it was. Kiss each other! <laughs> Cake's character is so over the top in this show. She just wants to see everyone f And then she just roasts people in a weirdly personal way as well. That's like all she does. Cake the cat. Since I'm giving out gifts, is there anything you desire? Ew! What is that creature? <laughs> what is that? Ew, 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 ew. Smiling friends. That's a smiling friends creature. Are you okay? I'm starting to freak out now. Okay, just chill out. They're gonna f Yeah, you're right. I take it back. They're gay. Where's the Donald Glover ASMR? He's like I deep in that microphone. Cool. I'm starving. Um. Have you heard of this place called Joy? Bring me back something. <laughs> <laughs> I low key wouldn't mind a whole episode of just those three characters, like in that specific multiverse. There's just no the magic or anything. It's just them fucking hanging out. Let's check that place out. It looks gnarly as hell. No, no, that place is forbidden. Coraline, Coraline, Coraline episode. This is my other Simon. He's a lot cooler. He's reminded me of the queen from Deltarune, bro. Hey, I'm here to pick up my order. Core, that was core. <laughs> that was not me. The person working the counter deadass looks like a core anime desk version. This must be why your biscuit boys are so special. He's blushing. I hate to ship every motherfucker in the show, but that's the entire intent of this series. I just feel like we need more man-on-man -man gay representation in animation. They're called the Lemon Carbs. They're these rich twins behind a food empire. Oh, do we have to hear more shitty Justin Roiland impression? I can't take it. <laughs> the dead one! Yeah, I haven't thought about her in a long time. But how could you say that? Why is everyone making fun of Simon's depression, bro? Like, this show is not pro mental health awareness. Have you tried being happy? Is someone cooking maple syrup in here? Because I smell something saucy! I don't like that. Dude, this is like the weird Barbie in the Barbie movie. So it's like reverse Adventure Time where the Princess Bubblegum is fucked up and Ice King is cool. Oh, right, the crown. <laughs> 
Ew. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I want to know. Is that like charge? I'm going to charge you from this reaction. <laughs> we can rescue them both. Action stuff. Is Fiona just becoming more dumb as the show She goes feels on? like a I side think. character in her own show. She does. Wait, you're stealing kitchen time? That's kind of punk. Why does Donald Glover sound so fucking cool in the show? Oh my god, he's doing a robbery. He's doing a robbery of all the sweets and all of the treats. Because he's a bad guy. Can't make cinnamon rolls without needing the dough. And I can't let you go. But she's a good singer, bro. Yeah, and it has JoJo coloring. Like, she's got that red keyboard. That keyboard's pretty expensive. I love this set piece. It's so beautiful. Whenever I first saw the Candy Queen at first, I thought that that was horrifying, but it's already grown on me. I now I want to f*** her. Everything okay? Uh, surprise. Dude, Marshall's actually a good guy. I thought he was going to rob their bitch ass, like some like staged crime because he unlocked the store. This is the feeling I've been chasing. Yeah. Murder? Violence? When is Fiona gonna have some character development? She's very directionless. Eh, it tastes nice, but I hate their little faces. <laughs> it's like you're eating a real living creature. If you buy the Choco Berry, you get a discount on Mr. Cupcake because they're married. That's actually kind of interesting. He made all the Adventure Time characters into candy. The reason they made this cartoon is because there's a warehouse sitting somewhere in China with thousands and thousands of plushies of all the Adventure Time characters. They're not selling them. And the warehouse told them, yo, we got to sell these or we're dumping them. And so HBO Max was like, we're going to make a cartoon to sell some plushies. There's something wrong with her brain, but it can be fixed. Uh, no, it can't. Knock her out. Yes, my kid. Is the fucking sword, like, corrupting her brain? Oh, it is. Because remember, in the beginning of the episode, we saw that the sword blew red, and red means bad. Fiona, indeed, you are both beauty and the beast. <laughs> I love Disney. I love Disney reference. I love Disney reference. I love cartoons. Okay. What? Oh, yeah, thumbnail. What? Huh? What's happening? Where'd his nose go? His nose! <laughs> she sucked! Oh my god! You sucked the fucking life out of him! Princess Bubblegum. I'm free! The curse has been lifted! It's good to see my fascist queen again. I thank you, brave knight. I'm not a brave knight. <laughs> I'm a sociopathic fucking murderer. What did I do wrong? You murdered a lot of people, Fiona. Did she actually do anything wrong, though? She basically liberated an entire world. Or maybe she's like pro-segregation and now she's mad. She liberated a world by committing genocide. That's Aaron Yeager, though. That's some <laughs> real Aaron Yeager shit right there. So, where does a chocolate-dipped strawberry go to meet a cupcake anyway? Christ, the world is crazy. Can you tell me how they put in the cream filling? Back there, I thought I was living my dream. But I was just hurting a bunch of innocent candy people. Jake did not oh. look like that as a baby. What the fuck is that disgusting little creature? <laughs> the next world will have a magic crown that will work. And I'll be cursed the right way. I'll be cursed the right way. Brofist. They should have put a dramatic sound effect on that. Dude, we're watching The Star. There was a really shitty Sony picture animation movie. Like it's a Christian movie called The Star and it's like really bad. <laughs> All I'm saying, if this video gets 20,000 likes, we'll watch it. It's about The Star of David. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a Christian movie. Bro, she got hops though. You see that shit? Oh, that vertical was her entire height right there. That looked like a dog in like a dog like competition. Like it jumps through a the hoop. Dog, <laughs> dog competition. <laughs> Fucking jumping through the hoop and shit. Man, that shit looked like a squirrel in a squirrel competition. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, dead guy. That's Simon. Is this like an alternate universe where Simon died and wasn't able to like take care of her? And then she started eating people. To cope, she got into microdosing psychedelic. So that's why there's all the shrooms. That's her personal collection. What's the matter? Oh, ew, ew. I'm watching like Tuka and Birdie right now. Like why are they fucking thick as hell? Why are they trying to make me f a goddamn cat? What are you talking about? <laughs> no one's trying to make you do anything, man. <laughs> They're trying to make me f 
the cat. Did you not read the fucking title credits that produced by Shane Dawson, you fucking assholes? It might only be good for one more crown dimension jump. We should go now. Weren't you listening? Oh, this is the world where Marceline took over. This is the world where no one ate her fries. Is that ultimately the world that we want? Because I think Marceline learned that, like, she can't always get what she wants. Yeah, but the thing is, like, she needs someone to eat her fries because it's like, otherwise she just gets too addicted she to fast food. It's like bad for your mental health, all the fatty foods. Huh? Fiona, stab it in the heart! <laughs> <laughs> she's so bad. Is she not capable of taking another? Per oh, never mind. I forgot she's killed a lot of people in the show already. It goes to show that Fiona is a significantly worse and more violent person than Finn. What? Finn at least grew up in a world where he had to kill to survive, arguably. Fiona grew up in a normal world and is totally okay with just instantly resorting to violence and stabbing people. She is a psychopath when you think about it. She grew up in New York, bro. She's watched a lot of serial killer documentaries. Yeah. Holy water. <laughs> <laughs> he knows by the taste. Nah, dude, holy water has a like weird disinfectant going on in it, bro. It tastes, I mean, not that, never mind. Have you drunk in holy water before? I never drank it, but you can smell the holy water, okay? You can smell it, okay? It's different than normal water. It has Jesus' seed inside of it, that's why. You left yourself vulnerable out there. Is that Princess Mad Max? Is that Zaria Bubblegum? <laughs> Am I supposed to like Zaria? Because I hate Zaria. She's like my least favorite fucking Overwatch character. She's like meta in Overwatch too. Cake. Bonnie. Th that says <laughs> That said <laughs> Seems our interests coincide after all. The Vampire King has the crown. Oh, the Vampire King is in this episode? No, the Vampire King's gonna be Marceline, bro. No, the Vampire King is a canonical character already in Adventure Time. He's like the lion guy. I'm gonna slay him or die trying. Now that is a party I don't want to miss. Doug Dimmadome? Doug Dimmadome is in Adventure Time? My name is Doug Dimmadome, and uh, I'm in Fiona and Cake now, because Butch Hartman worked on every episode. That's why the show is so dang good looking. Thank you, Butch. Navigation and artillery are up here. Sleeping tubes, armory. And the rest is a combination war room, rec room. Dang, this shit's like a capsule hotel. Oh my god, is that Huntress Wizard? Oh my god. Yay, Huntress Wizard moment. <laughs> and wait, was that Finn's dad? Oh my god, is that Finn's dad? I call him Garbos. What we really have to look out for is the star. Oh my god, it makes sense. PB's on the quest for Marceline's star. Be quiet, be quiet. The star has outlived the rest of his inner circle, trained by the VK himself. I love her so much. She sucks in this. What do you mean? She's cool. She's like vampire hunter. She's white. I was getting white vibes personally from the beginning of the show. <laughs> what? I forgot. He's a boss, baby. He can dance like a man. So in the intro song for Fiona and Cake, there's like that split second where Fiona's running and then it glitches and you see like Finn's hat. The hand is really tiny and you see it for one frame. It's actually Baby Finn in the intro for Fiona and Kate. What the fuck? So Baby Finn's like an important character now? Baby Finn is a very important character, I think. Well, he can dance like a man. And maybe that's how they resolve it with a dance off. If you let me out, I could easily just zap everything back to normal. Shut up. <laughs> Why doesn't he just do that? He's a chaser. Can we talk about this? He's definitely a chaser. Is that Marceline? No, this is the real world. This is the gay guys. Can it be a real world if there's gay people? Mom? Darling, you're here! Oh, he isn't homeless. He comes from a rich family. Oh, he's homeless for fashion purposes. He's like a rich person who cosplays being poor. That's cool. Do you know about that? Come on, I'll show you the moon. I can't believe you live in such a swanky place. Swanky? Swanky? You live in such a swanky place, Marshall. I love your show, Atlanta. Billy! Oh my god, Billy. Billy! Turn back. Turn back. Can you guys be quiet whenever Huntress Wizard is talking, please? Okay, I'll talk over all of her scenes. She said, yup. Do I have to, like, stop my sentence? <laughs> yes, you yes. have to. Show me. Help! Help us! We're we're stranded. Stranded. If they were Taurus in Mexico, they would not last, bro. I'm not supposed to pull over for this stuff, okay? I'm helping them. Hey! White people. They're gonna be evil, and it's because white people are dumb. Oh my god. Come with us. <gasps> yes. These things are so easy to kill. It's like a one shot. That is true. They die like instantly. 
Yo. What? Slay question mark? She's wearing like a goth Lolita type dress. She's wearing like a fucking anime cosplay, man. It's giving Madoka Magica Homura. That's literally what it looks like. Wednesday. <laughs> Oh my god, Finn's dad just got sucked off by Marceline. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> that is not what I fucking expected. Bonabelle, I think there's something wrong with your tank. <laughs> no, it, it's giving edgy anime girl character. Like, this is like that one girl in Data Live. It's enemies to lovers type shit. She literally gave her a kiss. Wait, are we just gonna get the exact same character arc that we got in Adventure Time already? It's like the Spider-Man thing. In every universe, Marceline and peanut butter bubblegum. <laughs> peanut <is> butter bubblegum. <laughs> Are always gay or whatever. <laughs> Marceline and Peanut Butter Gamer never get together. In every universe, Marceline and Peanut Butter make some jelly time. I'm your tank. This is terrifying. Cake's so gross. Like when Jake does it, it's normal, but when cake, just gross. That you should enjoy yourself. Oh. Does this become part of the plot or is it just like our gay break? Like our gay five minute refresher? I kind of like the gay break. Here's the hive. We'll split into three teams to make the drop. Cake and I will hit from the east. <laughs> Look at her fucking face. She looks like a legendary Pokemon. Huntress, you take the north. That she's putting down sentry wards in the fucking jungle and shit, bro. She's fast as fuck. What is that? Drank him dry and I wasn't even hungry. <laughs> You should have seen it. Whoa, that's an awesome outfit. Holy fuck. I'm not imagining Core wearing it. I'm not imagining myself wearing it. Core could wear this for sure. Maybe in this world, she didn't have a you. She didn't have a me. Yeah, because Simon made her not cringe. And like, <laughs> made her a normal human being. Without a father figure, you just become cringe. Without a father figure to teach you about cheers, you become cringe. Marshall has always had a rebellious streak. You might even say he fancies himself as hot-blooded. <laughs> he came to me and asked for re-entry into my world through the kind attention of the lemon carbs. He joined the bourgeoisie? No. No, Marshall. Don't become a part of the 1%. Don't become rich and successful. No. We did it! Yay! They're so fucking simple-minded. What is Fiona's MO in this show? I feel like she's just like there. Like she's just along for the ride. Well, I feel like Fiona was way more nuanced in the first episode of the show. And then when she entered the ma magical world, she just changed completely. Hey, give us the crown or I'll scratch you up. Agents of light. They killed Huntress Wizard. Eden. <laughs> They killed Huntress Wizard and Eden's looking at us. <laughs> sorry, sorry. They killed Huntress Wizard? I was checking in the email. I was checking his emails. It's okay. I didn't really like her that much anyways. I like the real Huntress Wizard more. Oh, because she's white? Because she's green. And like green is an attractive color. Green is not a creative color though. I'm gonna suck out your other eyeball. Choke on it. So easy to stake you. Yo, this is kind of hot though. Someone needs to draw the other perspective where it's like Marceline bent over as she's holding her down. <laughs> Fan artists have probably already done that, bro. Like that exists. Be careful, the remote. <laughs> Does Kitty want attention? You're kind of hot. But you have chicken feet. Was he trying to f cake? Well, they're both cats. I guess they're both technically feline. I ship it to be honest. Like I could see it working out one day. Gay! Yes! Gay people are gay. My gut feeling was to like be excited about that, but on retrospect, two gay ships? Well, it's technically one gay ship because they're the gender bent versions. Oh, okay. If it's one, then I'm fine with that. Oh my god, flashback to Simon and Betty? That rock is a fucking hole. Do you see that shit? That rock is a <laughs> that sounds like a Tyler the Creator song. <laughs> the rock is a nipple. I'm dating a cripple. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That was a le epic fail moment if I've ever seen one. That was a very genuine Adventure Time moment right there. Hey, at least we haven't seen any vampires here. Oh, great. We left Monster World and ended up in Crap World. <laughs> Good one, Cake. Good one, Cake. I could have taken that crown. It's all your fault. Yeah, it's my fault you're not dead. Second act, low point of the series. Oh. 
Jerry. Are we seriously doing a cold opening with text for Jerry? Is Jerry a character in Adventure Time? Jerry from Rick and Morty shows up in Adventure Time. That's freaking awesome. Are we gonna meet Prisma's boss and he's Jerry? <laughs> Orbo. You're up, mate. Dude, this guy's cool. Wait, that was the Bluey dad. The Bluey dad voiced him. What an immensely important character. Fucking Orbo. <laughs> she wasn't always an indecipherable goddess of chaos. She was human once. The most amazing. <laughs> Ew, that's such a bad drawing. That's like a fucking Gartic phone drawing. Betty and I first met at the library when we both reached for the same book. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't want to watch my fucking grandfather tell me 20 minute long stories, bro. I'm trying to escape. Jack, shut the uh, fuck up, okay? It's not my fault you didn't watch Adventure Time and you aren't attached to Simon and Betty, okay? I don't care. I just don't want to hear fucking old people talk about their old good old days, bro. An expedition to find the Enchiridion. <laughs> this episode is like way funnier than the last few. Excuse me, Dr. Petrikov? Wait, is he gonna date one of his students? What? He's a guest speaker, so it's not problematic, Eden. <gasps> it's Bimo! Is this Bimo Bimo? It's Bimo! I love Bimo! The Ice Kingdom? But where's the ice? Oh, yeah. That's weird. <laughs> what has Bimo been doing this whole time? Prismo? Nah, that guy's cool. He wouldn't do that. That guy's cool. <laughs> Bandit should voice more characters. Orbo's the goat, bro. He believes in Prismo. You're not the boss. Why don't I give them a call? Just be <laughs> So every fucking orbital being is just like a fucking weed smoking like awesome dude besides this fucking cricket guy. Just fucking rip one, bro. How do you end up with the job of being like a god? Is it bestowed upon you? Do you just spontaneously like exist? I think one day some cool ass dude picked the chillest guys in his frat and they all <laughs> ascended to the orbital plane together. It didn't get in my way. Wait! Doesn't this really give like a razzle boy and a spilling the milk girl? <laughs> Can a razzle boy and a spilling the milk girl find love? Can they go for an expedition together? Like, I don't even know. What are they searching for? Good content? Better content. <laughs> you think he passed away? Hey, I found some dirty tapes. Ice Spice's camera. Get it? She said I found some dirty tapes, but it's because they're literally dirty. And action. Uh... Every night I hear that blasted foghorn. <laughs> <laughs> You know, honestly, bring back Ice King, you know? Simon sucks. I agree. I agree. Did you find the Enchiridion? Swag S. Swag S in the background. Where? There was a cool S swag sign in the background. Doesn't she look like the girl from Infinity Train, like, grown up? She has red hair, yeah. She has glasses, red hair, and the fucking green sweaters. Like, literally the same girl. Goodbye, Petrikov. Oh my god, you actually went for the hand- not even a hug, not even a fucking hug, not even a fucking kiss? That was like a social distant ha handshake too, like they maintained complete separation. Pardon my late arrival, dear pedant. One is simply helpless without good help around. Aww. Is Bimo like the only being in this world now? I was gonna say, is Bimo schizo now? But they already were. Bimo's <laughs> even more schizo. <laughs> she reached a new level. One day, everyone was a skeleton. Then, Jerry came. <laughs> One day everybody was a skeleton, then Jerry came. Jerry Seinfeld. Jerry Seinfeld came with his 15 year old wife. Jerry Seinfeld is god of the world. I saw the book she checked out back at the library. Oh my god, did she ask her out with a note in the fucking book? What? This book is terrible. <laughs> it's written as if the author was aiming for an audience of one. His own ass? The book Riz is crazy. <laughs> that is insane. We gotta try this out. We gotta try this out. I'm gonna put this paper in every single library in the book to try to get someone, bro. Betty just left. She's finally going on that research trip to the Outback. What? You can probably still catch her at the bus stop. Run! That's so generic. Oh my god. She's literally standing right there. Did the creators of Fiona and Cake just binge like 200 shoujo anime before making this show? That's my bus. I... Goodbye. 
I don't even- your name, your name. A hug? No fucking way, just a hug. Makoto Aww. Shinkai could never. What if you use my robot heart to jumpstart this broken piece of trash? Wait, Bimo's gonna sacrifice himself to make the fucking remote work? Are you serious right now? <laughs> it's working! <laughs> Whoops. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> we can put him back the way he was, right? <laughs> no! No way! They're playing fucking dramatic music and her cat she just lowered it into the grave. They can't be serious right now. That was a free alarm clock though. Like, why did they throw it away? I forgot you know that tune. But you lived in my head, so that tracks. That was our song. Bro's gonna make everything about himself, dude. Like, come on, man. This man got pussy once and cannot get it. <laughs> like, move on, bro. <gasps> oh, look! Jerry's real! It's the lich. That's why everybody died, because he killed all life. Oh, and that's why only Bimo was alive. I guess I should have probably expected that, to be honest. A bad wish here, an embarrassing fanfic there, and we enabled it. He's a cool dude. His pickles are absolutely fire. His fanfics are not. Nice speech. Say goodbye to your legs. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I love Orbo. Shoot, I was hoping we wouldn't have to do this. What? Gaha. Uh -huh. You hate everything in that city! Not everything. I feel the tension so hard right now. <laughs> Shut up, dude. Let me enjoy the fucking show, asshole. Whatever happens next, I want you to know. I don't love you. I'm still beefing. We're still beefing. Goodbye, brain. Goodbye, Simon. Aww. Oh, gold. Because gold was Betty. I'm so happy that the Writer's Guild is over or whatever. <laughs> the Writer Guild is over. <laughs> <laughs> they dissolved the union. After the success of Fiona and Cake, HBO was like, all right, we'll let the writers write shit, bro. They wrote a masterpiece with this one, so we got to let them cook. Oh my god, she's in real adventure land. There's Hunter's Wizard, and there's that sloppy t Oiled up t Wait, this is the real one. No, she's having a dream, bro. Ooh. Oh, in the land of Ooh, there's no gay people allowed. So Gary and Marshall Lee disappeared from the world. <gasps> look, look. This is what Simon thinks of gay people. Oh my god. No, don't do it, Stanley. My spaghetti. <laughs> to be honest, this feels the most like a classic Adventure Time episode so far. Yeah, this episode's good. Are you happy, Fiona? Oh! What the fuck is going on? All this for you. I knew it was a dream, guys. That was a good dream, though. Let's go back. That was a nightmare! I had the worst dream. When Simon put on the crown, it all went wrong. Marshall Lee was a hideous, hideous monster, monster that burst, burst into, into flames. flames. They did not record that line in the same room as each other. That's what I was thinking. I was like, they're supposed to be in sync there, and they were so not in sync with each other. They were finishing each other's sandwiches right there. Oof, my butt is an icicle. <laughs> oh, that's gross. Cake suit, cake suit. But Kate couldn't give her like ice skates. No skates, no entry. Yeah, yeah, I'm going. Dude, this happened to me before. I went to an ice rink you as a kid. You wore a cat? Was, yeah, Cor. I wore a fucking cat. Is that so fucking hard to believe, asshole? Marshall and Gary? Wait, so gay is still allowed. Gay people are magic, so this is the new source of magic. Dude, Childish Gambino said cool threads. You've been thrifting, looking at the shitty cat on her body, bro. That is the shittiest outfit of all time. The crown. But he doesn't want to put it on. He does. No, I don't want to. I don't want to put on the crown. No. Just get in the darkness. Oh my god. Billy is cheeked up, man. Bro, he's just in Tetris right now. He's literally just playing Tetris right now. Why? Why must this be? I do like how big Golb is. Like it looks like a planet. I thought you were saying Golb was the lich's because it's fucking caked up, man. I keep looking at the Lich's ass the whole time. I haven't listened to anything he said so far. I mean, this is the first time we get to see the, the Lich's ass. The gold looks like the Behelet from Berserk, man. Wouldn't it be surprised if it's inspired, to be honest with you? 
Yo, that's sick. Yo, animation. We like it. They oh, turned him into a Tetris block. God. They didn't even turn him into a real piece. Like, that piece isn't even in the game. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Betty. You don't even have, like, an acoustic guitar or a ukulele. I don't really believe that this is a sincere apology. I want him to sing, like, Push, like in the Barbie movie when Ken was singing that to her. I met two people who really needed my help. Fiona and Cake. You would have liked them. Betty would not have liked them. Betty didn't like fucking anyone. She was a bitch in the original series. A bad bitch, thank you very much. It's now. By the order of Gibbon, find them. <laughs> Yo! Yo, Core got what he fucking wanted. Bro, I have literally been asking for this shit since episode one. What is this? There are reincarnations of Finn and Jake that appear in the last episode of Adventure Time. I like the monkey Finn. He's cool. Yeah, take that, Gibbon. And that. Oh, you got me. Quit wiggling around, you nugget. Or you're walking. I love how fucking tiny he is. Wait, Jake is a girl? We've been watching fucking Fiona and Cake the entire show. <laughs> and you're surprised that Jake is a girl? Well, it just looks exactly like Jake, but it has like a woman's voice. I mean, that's like the opposite example of where they have like a woman character. And it's like the boy looks normal. And then the woman animal has eyelashes for no reason. just happened what wait what what he's inside of his mind what the, the fuck, fuck? <laughs> what the Hello? fuck what the fuck is happening right now oh look at his hair is like simon's now you're not getting out of going to the library by acting weird that's great actually i could really use a library right now are you making fun of me <laughs> this is awesome i love her personality so shermy is supposed to be a reincarnation of finn but now simon is the host the holy spirit living inside Shermie's womb. Male womb. Why'd you have to say that? <laughs> Male womb? Do you hear me, Betty? Do you hear me, Betty? Oh yeah, this guy. I forgot he was a thing. The lich. He's not the lich. This is not the lich. The cockroach. He kind of does give cockroach vibes. Well, he turned him into actual beetles. He turned them into three people. Six. Okay, I know multiplication. Next is 12. Seven. No, 12, dumbass. <laughs> what? 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 He's got bugs on the brain. Oh, it's gonna get into Fiona's world. That's the spider. That's the anomaly. Fiona was never meant to be Spider Woman. <laughs> hey, hey, don't worry. We smoothed it over. Ew, ew. Oh, God. She does not care about, like, being creepy at all. They were just introduced to this concept of the cat. She's like, you want to see the most disgusting body horror you've ever witnessed in real life? <laughs> that was very satisfying. That was incredibly satisfying. They killed Turtle Princess. They ate her. They ate her. Turtle soup with Turtle Princess is probably delicious. Psst. Just throw some down. Preferably something about high technology, transcendental meditation, or trashy romance. Did she write the fucking Midnight Gospel show? That sounds like the three books that were the foundation for that entire series. Why are they all guns? There's a gun on the book because knowledge is a weapon. Oh my god, this is that one shitty episode of Adventure Time with all it's the It's not shitty. People. It's not shitty. That episode sucks ass, you have to admit. No, it's one of my favorite episodes. Shut up. Shut up, Lois. <laughs> huh? What? That's <laughs> like the worst fake whispering I've ever heard. That Ew, so... my God. That's so gross. For what purpose? So do we just keep them in jars like forever? Can someone use that like TikTok audio and then have like a Funko Pop or have like the, <laughs> my little pony figure in the jar? Do we just keep them in jars forever? <laughs> that is a good TikTok audio. TikTok, get on it. This world Simon Petrikov wrote a history of the crown too. The invisible forces of the universe. Oh, do they shoot the knowledge into their heads? Oh, no. I thought I was going to shoot the knowledge in the head. Fire once for yes, fire twice for no. This is such a ridiculously inefficient system. <laughs> <laughs> but book guns are cool. Book guns are awesome. They journey through the gobble bag caverns and lodge near a sunken city in the seaside town of Scandia. 
Oh my god, it's such kawaii anime 3D code Lyoko. Oh my god, yas. This looks like a hat in time. This feels like a fusion of like an old Dreamcast GameCube game and then like an old PC point and click type of game. Finding the crown is a literal matter of life and death for a whole world of living souls. I am digging the commitment to this bit. Simon's personality becomes so much more endearing when it's delivered by this fucking cartoony ass sounded voice. When he doesn't sound so depressed. Hey. I saw a glowing opening with blue sparkles out there in the park. I'll take you there. Let's go, Cake. Let's go, Cake. Turned into a fucking anime character for one second. Oh, fuck. Is LSP gonna ruin the day again? Oh my god! What are you doing to these beautiful creatures? Oh my god. Oh of my course. god! Of oh course. my fucking LSP god! Are you fucking kidding me? Never right does now? anything. Why? Good. <laughs> Does everybody know where they're headed? Instantly. Oh my God. That is the most realistic LSP thing to ever happen. And we now prepare ourselves for one full episode of Cheers. This episode of Fiona and Cake was filmed in front of a live studio audience. We're the studio audience, it's us. <laughs> Yo, this looks sick. What? It's 3D? Oh, this is the book. That's so cute. This looks like Space Jam creatures. What do you think we should do? Fire once for Casper's idea, fire twice for Nova's. I want to play this game. Like, I'm interested now. Boring. If this was Adventure Time, it would have been turned into a video game. But I feel like Fiona and Cake just doesn't have that same marketable plushy energy. You know what I mean? It, it feels like the kind of game I'd find on Steam on sale for like $2. It's incredibly buggy, almost impossibly difficult, but has the greatest aesthetic of all time. I have to. I have to. Oh, oh my, my god. god. There is an extensive amount of Simon ass. Like the people producing the show, I think they legitimately were more attracted to Simon than they were to Fiona. All the worlds you've visited, all the people you've infected. In fairness, like they did fuck things up for like a lot of people. Hand it over. <laughs> The baby. What the f The baby? The baby, dude. Oh my god. Hello. I'm Perry. <laughs> I'm Perry. Hi, Perry. Terry. <laughs> Perry died. Perry. 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 I knew him for so little time and I loved him so much. <laughs> Tree! <laughs> Motherfucker said tree. Bro thinks he's card cat or Sakura. You're not a cute, magical anime girl. No, Fiona and Cake's getting canceled! There will be no season two! Nova will hold the gate open long enough for Casper to grab the crown, but she'll be crushed. Or Casper drinks a potion. So he takes a shot. He takes a shot before going in. Beth, I don't want either of those things to happen. I like Nova. He's invested. Simon's invested in the story. Sorry, you're playing a morally complicated video game. You have to pick between two bad options. Choices matter in this game, okay? <laughs> this is Literally. like the walking dead. This ain't no telltale shit, bro. Things actually matter. I thought they were in love. They were, but it wasn't exactly on equal footing. But he could have been more thoughtful. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, he's asserting it to his own relationship. He could have. Oh, Betty did this just so that he would figure it out. Betty put him in a different fucking universe so he could figure out that he was not a good enough boyfriend. <laughs> That's kind of manipulative. That is extremely manipulative. That is hilarious. This is why I don't fuck with Betty though. <laughs> Cake. If Cake died right now, I wouldn't feel bad. That would be so funny though. <laughs> By the power of gay commanded in me. Are you more of a butter tart guy? I'll stop him. That would have been hilarious that that was his final line before he died. <laughs> Are you more of a butter tart guy? Just decapitated. Oh, Betty. Is that what it was like? He never munched her once, bro. That's the real thing. He was obsessed with him, but he never ate her pussy once. I could have made the effort to support you the way you always supported me. He's realizing, he's like, he always had her go down on him, but he never went down on her. I'll never enjoy anything on this <laughs> channel. Simon isn't a munch. Like, I don't know what to tell you. Let's go check out some petroglyphs. Really? 
you do that for me? You can't change the past, fuckwad. Yeah, you can't change the past. Maybe you should just accept this and move on, buddy. This isn't how it happened. No. We made our choices. Oh, wait. He's doing exactly that. My face when the brother in Christ is experiencing moving on. Is Betty Loki telling him, like, go, like, f another bitch? Yes. What happened? Are you okay? I'm okay. I accidentally got the ritual to work. Dude, this cell signal is fucking insane. <laughs> I didn't ask for this responsibility. It's too much. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Kidney stone. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch ass vomited a kidney stone. <laughs> oh my god, it's the Lorax. Not the Lorax. It's the Horton Hears a Who. It's the little speck. No one's going to get better unless someone cares a whole awful lot. <laughs> He's fingering himself. What the f but he put her world inside her world? This is Steven Universe Core. Think about it. Our universe was inside one dude for years and years, but it wouldn't be right for us to have it either. Does this make sense? I don't know. I don't know. It makes perfect sense. Shut up. I wish. Is she gonna say I wish everything was back to normal? Fuck off. Betty's hot. Like, Gold Betty is hotter than regular Betty. Huh? They're legit now? How did that happen? This sucks. Bullshit. He literally reached into his ass and shoved it in his head. <laughs> it was a literal ass pull. Bro missed the whole show, true. Prisma missed, like, the biggest plot twist in his entire fan fiction. That guy's just not cool. There's gotta be something I can do. Where's Orbo? Where's Orbo when you need him? Ah! Ma'am. <laughs> oh my god, baby, baby Finn. Finn. Oh, I knew it was gonna happen. I really wanted to think for a second that it was just Baby Finn. So it's all the characters from the other episodes randomly teleport. This is the most fan fiction bullshit I've seen in my fucking life. Can What? What? Ew. Top fantasy? Oh my god, she's Jack. This isn't just fan fiction. This is fan service. <gasps> Jay! Heads up! She clapped it with her cheeks. That is fucking cool, though. <laughs> Holy she basically shit, shit all over him. There's the nothing left to say. Song. That's a li they literally like, there's nothing left to say. We ran out of shit to write. I really wanted to like this so bad, but this is some fucking dumbass. It's episode 10. You can't get me with just, oh, that's the character that I know from that one episode. I'm done, okay? Just end the fucking show already. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, get it, because it's like the Horn Years Who. Because if you, uh, one person cares a whole lot about making a stupid fan fiction version of Adventure Time, they'll make it. If you loved Fiona and Cake fan fiction and you want more fan fiction, subscribe and leave a like on the video. We're going to make more fan fiction. We're going to do a whole comic series about Fiona and Cake. Thanks to our patrons. Alejandro Paredes, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kane Rivers, Kamlu, Cosmic Dega, Chris. Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, Diane Stalk, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granado, Gub Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Gunny Snow Unison, Helio, I Pegged Brett Hand, Isaiah Alford, Kamui, Catherine Wright, Night VDB, Leaf, Lilac Moon, My Artistry, Master Nate, Matthew Byers, Mowry, Solomon Graber, Native, Nick, Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Pitchin Witch, Him is Best Boy, Rain, Steven Sanchez, Sunny D, Tyrant Sills, Toast, Ultimate Parson, Bell Explicit, Victoria, Wyatt Line.